And number three is a little bit more complicated, but not too much. And it's about Ben going to get a haircut. And he has $25 in his pocket. And let's circle the math. The cost of the haircut is $20. The sales tax is 4.75%, but the tip is 15%. So these two costs are added on to the cost of the uh, haircut of $25. Does they want to know, does he have enough money in his pocket to pay for the haircut, the tax, and the tip? He only has $25. So let's look at that. Well, uh, I can combine or add these two tips or these two percentages, and I get 15 uh, plus 4.75%. They're both percents. And I can get a total percent of 19.75%. Okay, so I'm going to be spending 19.75% above the $20. Uh, so if I take that amount, the total amount, and multiply that times the cost of the haircut, which is $20, so times 20, do I get the total cost? And that would be, or the part, or anyways, that would be the cost. Uh, so let's do that. Let's get rid of this here and divide by 100. So I get 0.1975 times 20. And I get uh, $3.95. $3.95. Those are the cost uh, of the tip and the tax. And if I take that and add it to my $20, I have $23.95 total. Well, the, the question is asking, does he have enough money because all he has is $25? Well, the answer is yes. He can go get his hair cut. Thank you. Bye-bye.